Hey guys, it's Charity from A Loop and a Hook, and today I wanted to show you what I got at thrift stores and salvage stores over the past few weeks. There's also a few, um, this entire side over here, stuff that I was able to get at Free Piles. So, I'm going to just go through show you what I got for the past two weeks. So, first thing we got is, I think there's like seven of these, guacamole salsa, and these Colin really likes. These were 50 cents each, so I thought that was a really good price. Got two things of yeast for $1.99. I didn't have any of that, so that was a good price. I got a few more Bang Energy Drinks for Colin. Those were $1.29 each. A roll of Thank You For Your Order stickers. Let me see if I can focus real quick. There we go. So I got this roll of thank you for your order stickers. These were a dollar for this entire roll. My guess is these are like a thousand of the thank you stickers. And let's see. I think that was all that I got in this. These, This was all from the salvage store. I did get this bag of kitty litter that's 50 pounds for $3, which I thought was a really good price. Then over here, I got three glasses. These were 25 cents each. These also came from a garage sale. There's this cute little red one. This bigger red one. These were also 25 cents each. Got these because we run out of glasses. We didn't get many. Um, so we run out of them frequently and if we ever have people over we wouldn't have enough and we'd have to resort to using either paper or plastic. So I picked those up because those were a really good price. So then in this bag I got this game in a pickle. It is a Dr. Toy winner. I've never heard of this game before but it, it looked like it was fun to play. Figured it was something I could add to my game collection. This was $1.99. Got a book for 50 cents. Then in here, what else? Oh, got a Pampered Chef ice cream scoop for a 50 cents. I believe this was 50 cents. Then canning jar for 69 cents. Just got one of those big quart ones. I believe I got three of these glass. Um, I don't know what they're called, but they have like the seal on them. Um, these were 99 cents for these, which I thought was a good price, but let's see. Oh, I got five of them. There's four more in there. I got pint jars, 69 cents each. There's one. Oh, I only got one of those. And then I got this really, really cute little like canning jar, mason jar bug thing with the lid for 69 cents. I really like how cute that little guy is. Then I got 12 of these glass with metal lids. I think they're made for spices because when you open them up, they have like the shaker on there. And these were 69 cents each, which I thought was a really good price for these. Over here, everything on this pile is everything I got for free. I got some textbooks right there. Um, a book about the Adirondacks, which will probably go to grandma. A uh, Nancy Drew book. It's falling apart a little bit, but for free, you can't really beat the price. Um, a cat care book for our cats. This is my favorite book, and I saw this and I just had to get it. Little Owl's Night. They do have more in this series that I'm hoping to get, but I really like this, and it's a board book, which means it's almost indestructible. Just something I appreciate. I got... Frog and Toad All Year and Adventures of Frog and Toad. I've read these when I was a kid and they're super cute so I decided I'd pick those up. Um, this is one in the Red Wall series, another really good series that I liked. <clears throat> Rebecca Sunbrook Farm, another classic book. Little Men, I love books by Lu Louisa May Alcott and I didn't have this one so this was a good addition little pamphlet. Um, this one is the L.L. Bean Book of New England Cookery. It's like almost brand new. So I picked that up. 
We've got a Mandy book, a C.S. Lewis book, America's Test Kitchen Bake Ahead Cook. Thought this one looked good and I figured I can go through it, pull out anything. But there's not much I can find in there, I can redonate it. I also got Cook's Country, Best Grilling Recipes. Got a The Zoo book. And then Clean Eating. Clean Eating, Sarah Plain and Tall, another C.S. Lewis book, and then Dick and Jane. I was able to get this blender for free, which is really good because I didn't have one that really worked well. So I'm gonna replace that. Found Tightwad Gazette, a smart guide to the Bible, some more books that I got that some ladies at church were getting rid of. Pilgrim's Progress, that's one I did not have yet. And then I got this one, which was a really good book for me to read when I was looking to get into a relationship and this one I really recommend. I got this one because it is something that I would be willing to loan out to people and I'd rather have a few of them just in case one doesn't come back to me. Then in this last bag I was able to get this refillable soap dispenser and this was something I'd been looking for but I didn't really want to pay for it. Um, but this is going to be, I'm hoping to make homemade hand soap so we're going to see um, when I make that, I'm hoping to do a video on it, so you should see that coming sort of soon. We've got nice Pyrex dish. There's one. And then there's two more of the little ones. I got a mini waffle maker, which I have one of these. I wanted two to make it go a little bit quicker. I love mine. And they make the most adorable waffles that really could pass for an Eggo waffle. Oh, there is another Pyrex dish. I forgot that one was in there. Got a CD. This is one of the hymn books that our church has. Then I got a whole bunch more books in here. Um, I was able to get Pampered Chef measuring spoons, which are always helpful. I got a set, there's more down there, a set of more measuring spoons, a crochet hook, and then a one and two cup measuring cup. So thank you all for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. I was really, really excited to be able to find so much of the good deals this these past two weeks. I didn't get much of a chance to go out to thrift stores this week, so I'm hoping to hit some in the next week. This week was just really busy with my work schedule and everything. So Thank you all for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video, and we will see you for the next video. Bye!